Hey everybody, it's Randolyn here. Um, Randolyn of Nixlin's Reptiles, although technically formerly Nixlin's Reptiles. Um, I just wanted to do a quick video of a snake room and baby update and an update about the business. Um, we are now the Bio Boutique. <laughs> It was about time that we did this name change. Um, Nixalyn's Reptiles was just kind of a placeholder for me selling my snakes. But Bio Boutique is kind of in a culmination of everything that my sister and I do. Oh, this guy's starting to get pissed. Um, my sister Amethyst and I both do a lot of different uh, art, some taxidermy and wet specimens. And we do plants and some bioactive materials and lots of different isopods and just an array of things. Um, and so then I also do the snakes and then my sister has a few snakes and some geckos. So it was just an evolution that needed to come, which was to make our whole business bio boutique. So what we're looking at here real quick are my pumpkin head Sumatran short tail pythons. This guy right here is the father roach of these little babies from this year. Um, and on my website, you'll see some animals available. Our new website is bioboutiquekc.com. But we don't have any more yellow heads available, unfortunately. I put this one away because he's angry. Um, I sold out of these really quick. I mean, obviously, because they're super pretty. I mean, they are so colorful, and this this lighting is just terrible. But check out that baby. Um, but on the website, I have some other stuff available. And you on our website, you can find our Etsy, which has a lot of our taxidermy. And, you know, all that good stuff. <laughs> so, yeah, it, the, Nixon's Reptiles has just evolved. Um... But let's take a quick look around. My snake room has also kind of evolved. Look at that head. He's a pretty boy. Uh, there's lots of new things and projects happening. And I just got new enclosures. So I think it's time to show everybody. Oh, look, there's a Doomerals baby. Let me put this other guy away. There we go. So... I don't remember what I was talking about. I know a lot of people come to my channel for Doomerals boas. So here's a quick look at this year's babies. Um, we had 19 Doomerals and every single one of them is now on frozen thawed mice or rats. Uh, I've been changing it up some mice and rats and they are eating really good. Um, I still have a few of these available, surprisingly enough. I've sold quite a few and I'm keeping quite a few, but some are still available. I am not shipping for the rest of the year, just between holidays and cold weather and whatever. But if someone's interested in any animals, again, go to our website, bioboutiquekc.com, or just send me a message and we can talk about any of my available animals. Oh, this one's running away. Oh, no, now you're stuck. So the doom are doing real good. Let me take you around the rest of the snake room as I destroy everything <laughs> and we'll see what else is happening. So the room has changed a little bit. Here we go. It's a disaster. I'm still in the middle of changing a lot of things. All these white AP cages are new. I've got oh, all my doom rolls are in these six and eight foot cages. Over here, some tarantulas and my 2019s. Um, here's a project for this year. I mean, I've been trying to get this lady to breed forever, and it looks like maybe this year for once, finally. Maybe this will be the year. She's a Brazilian rainbow boa. And then we also have a bunch of carpet pythons from this year that I am just in love with. So all of them have shed in the past couple of days. This is one of my favorites. As angry as she might be. Um, let's see, we got a couple other carpets. There. This one's really pretty. Um, this one's in blue right now. So yeah, carpets are doing really good. They're all eating frozen thawed like crazy. 
Oh, this one's gonna run. Bye, buddy. They're still pretty shy and pretty snippy. That one might run too. Um, this is the baby rack. Those are some of the doom rolls left. And then I also have a lot of chrome heads left. Oh, it's cleaning day. So all of these guys are going to get cleaned. This is why they need cleaned all the time. because they sit under their water bowls. So there's a couple babies. Um, like I said, I still have a few of these left. Look, see every single one of them. Lots of different patterns and colors on these guys. I love my chrome head short tails. They're all doing really good. Chowing down on Frozen Thawed. Oh, sorry. Some of these tubs are a little sticky. Look, Classic pose right there. So, snake room's changing. I still got a lot of snakes to kind of move around. Oh, look, there's Hathor. Uh, this entire wall is short tail python, short tail python, short tail python, short tail python, and short tail python up there. These are empty because I'm still doing some moves. But let me show you out here with some other new stuff that's happening because <laughs> my snake room has exploded. We're now in two rooms, kind of. My turtles are still over there. But then up here I have a bunch of uh, propagation boxes because one of the things that we're doing with BioBoutique is a lot more rare plants and terrarium plants, so com common terrarium plants and some rare stuff. So you can see a few of my bioactive planted gecko terrariums and I have another gecko terrarium down there. Uh, let's see, down here is my Madagascar hognose. Then I have all my adult carpet pythons out here in these antique neos. Oh, here's Khalid, Clarice. Hello, Clarice. And let's see, over here I've got my two male Brazilian rainbow boas. And down here I have another Madagascar hognose. So yeah, my snake room is now, is now two rooms. I just had too much stuff. Oh, yeah, and I have stacks and stacks of isopods over there. I mean, there's just so much down here. It's not even funny. But things are changing. Things are evolving. I'm trying to get this business going. We're trying to do more shows. It's a disaster. Um, let's see. Let's take a look in this rack real quick. Got a bunch of blackheads in here. So, I'm going to leave you guys with... Let's see. Oh, look. You're in blue. You know, follow me on social media. Say, I should say follow us as Bio Boutique KC. And go to biobutiquecasey.com. I'm going to try to post more videos now that school is almost over. And I'm kind of reinvigorated with my snakes. And I want to get back into snakes. And I got a lot of stuff pairing this year. Oh, that's Hathor. She's such a pretty girl. She's probably going to pair again this year. Um, but yeah, I guess that's it. I will see you guys later. Thanks for listening to me rant.